A nurse dead, her body found by police, a suspected suicide. The nurse who had worked at the hospital where Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, was treated for morning sickness this week, had put a call through to Kate's ward, thinking the caller was the queen. We called the hospital where Kate Middleton... But it was actually Michael Christian and Mel Gregg, a pair of Australian DJs famous for hoaxes, who placed the call and were gloating about it all week. Can you believe what has happened today? You know what? They were the worst accents ever. Pity the poor nurse, Jacinda Saldana, who was blindsided by the call. Oh, hello there. Could I please speak to Kate, please, my granddaughter? Oh, yes. Just hold on. Um... Thank you. They were put through to the ward nurse, who gave the hoax callers an update on yes. Kate's condition. She, she's stable at the moment. The royal family made no complaint. The hospital apologized, the radio station apologized, Prince Charles, Kate's father-in-law, even joked about it. How do you know I'm not a radio station? <laughs> and the episode, while embarrassing, seemed to be over until the nurse's body was found. The Australian radio station has now taken the offending DJs off the air and offered condolences. While the police have said they can't call this a suicide until after an autopsy, the hospital in its statement said it had been supporting its employee through what it called this difficult time since the hoax. The Australian radio station had been boasting that the hoax was what it called the prank the world is talking about. Well, the world is talking about it again, Scott, but as a tragedy. Mark, thank you.